<sighs> you know, thanks again for helping me clean up after the party. There is quite a lot. I, I know it's no problem, but I still appreciate it. <sighs> oh, I'm so tired. But, no, it was nice seeing everybody. Especially those I haven't seen in a long time. And I know they had a good time with the amount of <laughs> cups that are lying around. I'm happy you had a good time, too. I wish... And I wish... You know, these kind of things, these get-togethers, you know, like... You know, just kind of what, you know, comes around Christmas time with everyone just... I don't know, I feel like I wish we could do that all the time. You know, around Christmas time, people actually make time to see people and spend time together and have these kind of parties and... I wish we could have more of that. I mean, granted, I guess, you know, that you could make the argument that if you did it all the time, then it wouldn't be as special, but... I don't know, because now I gotta wait a whole year until I get to do this again. Until I get to see everybody in one place. It's just... It's just really nice. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't, I didn't mean to get all sentimental. I, uh, all, I mean, all you did was offer to help me clean up, not listen to me rant about... <laughs> Wishing we were having more parties or whatever. Oh. Well, uh, I... I'm glad what I was saying made some sense. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's not just the party or, like, you know... Just... I mean, I don't... I mean, obviously, I don't... <laughs> can't celebrate Christmas year-round. Because then, yeah, then that would lose its... Then that would lose the magic of it all, you know, how special the holiday is, but I don't know, I just think the get-together should be more of a regular thing. <laughs> and, well, you know, maybe parties too, I think those are really fun. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh. <sighs> Well, maybe we can try to set some of those up during the year and hope that people actually attend. <laughs> I feel like there's some kind of obligation around Christmas, you know, like, oh, like you have to, you know, show up. Otherwise, it's like seen as rude or it's bad. It's like a, it's like an innate thing. Like, you know, that's like the one day out of the year that you have to like make time and see people. Sometimes it's people you don't want to see. <laughs> Thankfully, that wasn't the case today. But, well, I don't know. Just my two cents. Maybe we can have, like, another mid-get-together, like in, like, what? Like, what's the middle of the year? Is that, like, July? <laughs> I don't know. I'm just talking out loud. <laughs> oh, those? Um, uh, you know what? You can you can take those with you if you want. I have too many cookies in this house. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I am. Uh, yeah, me and the I got some help from the fam and uh, baked quite a bit, so you can take some home. Yeah, I don't mind. You know, I mean, I guess it's considered a thank you for helping me clean up after the party. Plus, I know you like those, so. <laughs> yeah, I'll just I'll wrap it up for you before you go. Something on your mind? 
Now you seem kind of distracted. You sure? Okay, okay. Just asking, just asking. You know, when one sees one's friend looking a little, you know, off, you just ask. Well, no, I'm not, no, I'm not saying you're off. I'm just, I don't know what I'm saying. I just thought it looked like something was on your mind, so I asked. <laughs> well, I think we got most of it all cleaned up. The rest of it I gotta just shove in the fridge. Oh, but, um... Do you mind helping me bring these crock packs back in the pantry over there? <laughs> I have quite a few. Um, thankfully, I did. I mean, people ate a lot. A lot more than I expected. Uh, yeah, yeah just uh, that one right there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Again, thank you so much for helping me with all this. This would have taken me hours to do by myself. Okay, not hours, but I'm tired. I'd probably be all sluggish afterwards if I was cleaning up by myself. You know, like, and I probably would have been too lazy and I would have waited to clean up till tomorrow and that would have been a whole thing. Uh, yeah, just place them right there. <sighs> I guess that's it. <laughs> You're, uh, free to stay over for a uh, cup of hot chocolate, if you like, before you go. I know I said I was tired, but I mean, I was gonna lounge around and drink hot cocoa anyway, so. <laughs> Having you tag along, I don't think will tire me out. <laughs> What? You just like, you. What? Yeah, something's up. What is it? Why are you pointing up? I. <laughs> what the heck? Why did that get up there? No, I didn't put that up. No, no, um, someone was carrying that around today. Uh. Oh. Um. Was it George? Maybe it was George? Georgie boy? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, he had it tied, um, he had like one of those little hat, mistletoe hats on, and, uh, you know, he was, like, <laughs> been teasing everybody for, for a kiss or something. Mm hmm Yeah, yeah, he, um, <laughs> he kept on annoying Devin. He was like, he, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was, uh, it was funny. He was like, give me a kiss, Devin. Devin's like, no, George. <laughs> yeah, it's funny. But I guess he decided to uh, tie it up in my pantry. I don't even know how he got it up there. I mean, you know, George isn't... I mean, he must have... He, must, he had to have gotten a chair. He's not that tall. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, but no, no, it's fine. You know, <laughs> calm down. I don't, I don't have, we don't, we don't have to guess or anything. I mean, <laughs> I mean, it's a, just an old tradition that was actually, I don't even know who it was made up by or why they decided to choose this plant to kiss underneath. I mean, it's, I mean, yeah, like who, who came up with this anyways? Like I, I'm actually genuinely curious as to like what was the reasoning behind this. I'm sure there's a reason. There's probably like a whole wiki forum as to why mistletoe is the kissing plant. I don't know. <laughs> Granted, it is a Christmas tradition. <laughs> I'm kidding. Don't get so scared. I'm like, we don't have to unless you want to. I'm teasing you. I'm teasing you. I'm just teasing. I'm just teasing. But we could. <laughs> no, I'm teasing. I'm teasing. But I, I'm just saying that we could, even though I'm teasing. But I'm saying that we could. I mean, I don't know. I've never kissed underneath the mistletoe before, so it's... 
kind of interesting to me that I find myself underneath one. Like, I never thought just, I don't know, I thought it was, like, a thing that only, like, they put up, like, in the past. Or, like, it's a thing that's only, like, in movies, you know? It's just kind of funny to me that, like, we're both underneath one. Like, what what coincidence is that, you know? I don't know. I'm just saying that I think it'd be kind of, I don't know, funny story or something. <laughs> but obviously, if you're uncomfortable with it, we don't have to. It's totally fine. So yeah, we can just go make the hot cocoa and... What? Oh. Oh, uh, okay. Um... <laughs> Are you sure? I mean, I, I, I'm not... I mean, I was just joking before, really. I mean, we don't have to. I... Oh, um, okay. Yeah. Yeah, um... Yeah, I'd like to, too. I've never kissed underneath the mistletoe before, so... Um... <laughs> I guess I just realized now we're in the pantry. This is quite a story, huh? I should probably stop talking. <laughs> um... Uh... Do you want me to just lean in or I guess we can just both close our eyes and see where we meet yeah I think that sounds like a good idea Uh, well, that was a little more than just one kiss, but... <laughs> no, no, I... I liked it. And, you know, we're still standing underneath the mistletoe, so... We could kiss again. <laughs> Well, I wasn't expecting this to happen when you agreed to help me clean up for the party, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> and you know the offer for some hot cocoa still stands, if you want to stay a little longer. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, it's homemade. No, no, I don't do that powder stuff. <laughs> oh, come on. Let's get you some hot cocoa. 